you know, a lot of times on the show, we have segments that, well, they just make you smile. And that's what this next one is going to do. Let's go ahead. Welcome to the show, Laura Gregory. Laura Gregory is the secretary and treasurer of the Ragamuffin Cat Society, a, an apprentice judge, part of the council secretary for the Ragamuffin breed, which I am continuing to learn about this morning. Good morning, Laura. How are you? Good morning. I'm doing well. Thank you. Okay, so before we get started, Ragamuffin, I know uh, the kind of breed, and I'm assuming the breed of cat you are holding right now in your arms. Will you introduce us? This is Pertastic Muffin's bow of Ragtime Cats. He's a silver tabby and white ragamuffin. So, Laura, we are so excited to, to welcome you to the show because I feel like, especially, you know, coming off of, of Thanksgiving, you know, the dog show is a tradition, you know, in my house. We're talking about a cat show today, Laura, that a lot of people in the Bay Area are big fans of. Go ahead and tell us about it. Well, we're having a CFA championship cat show along with a household pet show. And we have over 100, 175 um, exhibitors who will be coming from around the country, bringing their cats to compete. And um, it's kind of like what you would see in the dog show when you see the small dogs competing. <laughs> Um, where you see them put on a table and judges, we have 10 judges coming from around the country who will be examining them. So it actually counts as 10 separate shows and each judge will examine them. They will pick their top 10 best and award ribbons to those cats. They also receive regional and national points toward our year end awards. Well, let's break it down too. I was reading that there are four different competitive categories. What are those categories? Yes, we have um, kitten class which is for kittens that are eight months and younger. Those are our little kids starting out. And Bo right here is actually a seven month old. So if he were competing, he'd be in the kitten class. And we have what we call our championship cat class, which is as soon as they turn eight months old, if they're going to be a breeding cat, they go into the championship class. Then we have what we call premiership, which is the opportunity for cats that are neutered and spayed, but they are still um, pedigreed cats. And that's unlike the dog world where we do allow our neutered and spayed cats to still compete. So those pedigreed cats can go in that class if they are neutered and spayed. And then we have lastly our household pet class. And household pet class can be any cat that doesn't have any papers and um, they can just come and compete and have fun. It's a very enjoyable class. It's a class that a lot of people start out in. Uh, well, uh, speaking of fun though, there's two other things I wanna make sure and get to. First off, Yes, there will be a cat costume contest. This has got to be a fan favorite. Yes, it is. Um, people just love our costume contest, which happens probably approximately around noon, and we will do it both days. Um, our members bring costumes and dress up our kitties, and it's a real big um, popular thing. You get to see cats dressed up in all kinds of wonderful <laughs> costumes, and they really get out there and have a lot of fun with that. Our judges will judge those costumes. A lot of times they'll ask the um, spectators, you know, to get in on it and cheer for their favorites. So, so you gotta come along and uh, come see it and cheer for your favorite kitties. They By the way, <laughs> I also read that there was gonna be a mall. You had me at mall, meow <laughs> mall, in fact. Yes, we do have vendors. Cat shows are one of the best places to buy for your kitties. Um, you will find cat trees, and I always find they're some of the best cat trees that you can get because they're Aww. designed by cat breeders and so on for us to uh, have the opportunity. And they're usually a little less expensive than what you find in the stores oh, too. Okay. So you can come get really good quality cat trees and then just all kinds of miscellaneous items for cats to play with and then just goodies for, for you, whether it be purses Aww. and things like that that you can find for yourself that are for cat fans. Just have fun. Well, the information is on the bottom of the screen right there. So you can go out and get tickets. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure to have you on the show today, Laura. You're so welcome. Thank you for having us.